Hi guys, welcome to simplyhike.co.uk. Today I'm going to be talking to you about Berghaus's Verdun 60 plus 10 rucksack. Now this rucksack is perfect for Duke of Edinburgh Awards, um, general backpacking, or if you're going for a nice weekend hike. Let's go through the spec, shall we? So the bag itself is 60 litres plus 10. So the 60 litres is actually in its core of the rucksack. So from top to bottom, you have the 60 litres. And the plus 10 are two pockets on the side there, which once I go through the features of the bag, I will show you. Um, the bag itself is made out of ripstop material, which means no matter what sort of climate that you're walking in, um, no matter how you treat your bag, it's gonna make sure it's really nice and strong. So no matter what sort of direction or pull the bag's getting, no matter, to say, if you snag it on stuff, it's gonna hold, the, hold its own really, really well, which is a really nice feature and a really key feature in this rucksack. Right, so. Let's go through some features. Obviously you've got the traditional mesh pockets on the side there for your walking bottles or anything like that. If, you know, you've got a little down sleeping bag, you can pop it on the side there and attach it to the side using the straps. Um, yeah, yet again, it's nice and elasticated on the top as well, so it's gonna keep everything in there nice, safe and secure. Um, talking about the side panels, you have pole grips. Now these work with the compression straps that are on the side. So you put your pole in the bottom there and then you get it to sit in the bottom part there. So when you tighten up the compression strap, it holds your, your pole and then basically makes it nice and secure on the outside of the bag, which is a really nice little feature. Obviously, you have the traditional uh, straps that you get on the outside of rucksacks, see to compress it down, or if you wanted to add like roll mats or anything to it, you know, the general universal stuff that you can, that you can use, so on the bottom and on the top here as well. And as I said, you've got the compression straps on the side, either side. So once all your gear's in, once you've packed your bag, pop them, pop them back in, tighten them up, and that stops anything and everything from rattling around. Right, obviously on the outside of the pocket of the bag itself, you have, if I just undo it, the bottom entry point of the rucksack itself. So if I open it up, there we go. So as you can see, You've got nice amount of space in the bottom panel here. So you can either, with this rucksack, either have it all as one open space, or at the moment I've got it sealed off at the bottom. So if, so if you definitely are doing Duke of Edinburgh, you've got a pair of dirty boots, you just want to keep them separate from all your clean gear, whack them in the bottom, that keeps it all separate, and then yeah, nothing else will get dirty. What you can also do though, is using the zipper on the side, if I lay it down, it's probably a lot easier using the zipper it creates it as one open space so I now have access from bottom to top and top to bottom so that's a really nice feature as well because nine times out of ten the stuff that you always want is always at the bottom so just having that as a, as a nice little separator but as I say because you can unzip it is a really nice and a really key feature of this rucksack so that's the bottom part of the rucksack do it up, cover that over. Let's talk about the top part. So, if I get rid of the, get rid of the head part of the rucksack. So, as you will be able to see, the inside is nice and spacious. You do have a, a nice lot of room in there. As I say, this, this part here, as well as the little extra on top, is this, the 60 litre capacity in there. So you've got loads of room, um, perfect for, you know, your weekend away or, you know, your four day, DV hiking trip. Well, you will also see inside, if you can see that in the video, let's have a look. Ooh. If I can get it, maybe I can pull it down. Yeah, let's pull it down, it's probably even better. This bag here, this is for your hydration pack. So if you do have a camelback or an Osprey system, pop it in there, that can go through the top, which is, it comes through there, and then you can attach that to the strap part of your rucksack. Right, so that's the key features on the front part. Let me just clip this in, and then I'll go from head to toe on the back part. So, on the rear bag, obviously the rear part of the bag, you have this top storage compartment at the top here. Now, this opens up nicely to a lot of headspace. Now this one here, you know, if you've got your MP3 player, your mobile phone, or you know, your, your pack like jacket, you can have it in there, stored away, and then away you go. Even if you've got, you know, your Kendall mint cake stash that can live in nicely in there, so then you can pull it out and munch away. That's actually quite a nice, uh, you know, storage area to have. What you will see directly underneath that zip 
We have another zip, and this is for the rain cover. Now this rain cover here covers the front part of the bag itself. Now the bag is water resistant, but if it's absolutely properly hammering it, hammer, uh, hammering it down, obviously you've got, you know, you've got stitching and all that sort of thing. With, you know, you just want to make sure that everything's 100% covered. That's what that's there for. So you cover it over and it will, you know, just give you a lot more protection from the, from the rain itself. Right, so the back system itself has a biofit system. So the actual way that the actual these little parts of the actual bag itself fit um, almost, not completely, but they pretty much fit your back system so over time you'll get a nice comfortable feeling um, on your back and obviously if you're taking a lot of weight, so if you are doing Duke or Edinburgh it's going to be you know, a real asset to you, it's going to make your hiking a lot more comfortable. Obviously when it comes to the adjust you do have this string pull system here um, and what that does, that enables you to raise or lower the back panel part of your rucksack. Obviously, depending on what you're, you know, what you're carrying and what you're, you know, how you're feeling on the day, you're going to want to adjust it. And it's purely as simple as just pulling the cable that way, and then, as you can see, that enables it to go all the way to the top. But it's nice and locked in there, so there shouldn't be any issues. So once the weight's on your back, your back's on it. It'll keep it nice and stable for you. Obviously the BioFlex or the BioFit also works nicely on the hip strap as well. So it's thin in areas and it's thicker in areas. This is basically going to shape your hip system around, around your body, should I say, a lot more comfortable. It's going to you know, make your hiking, yet again, a lot more comfortable working, obviously, with the bar system and then the cushioning. The last thing really, which is key, is the good old trusty Berg buckle. Now this is a nice bit of kit from Berghouse um, and it's as simple as that. But that can take a lot of pressure, a lot, actually a lot more pressure than your conventional clips. This one can actually take a lot more pressure from that. Thus, you know, you know, if you're halfway up a mountain, it's happened to me loads of times, and all of a sudden I've just put a little bit too much pressure on, and it's gone, clip, popped up, and then you try and clip it back in, and it's completely and utterly useless. It never feels right again. You don't get that issue with the Berghaus. The more pressure you put on it, the more it actually holds its own weight. It's a fantastic system from Berghaus. Um, what I'm going to briefly talk to you about now is the Plus 10. So I just take some bits off of here, loosen this up. Let's tighten it up, Sean, well done. Come on. Nope, you don't want to do it. Brilliant. So the actual Plus system is you've got five litres this side, and you've got five litres this side. And it's as simple as just an extra storage. As I say, you can get excess from the front part of the rucksack as well as the back. You know, so you can put out additional water bottles in there. If you've got a thermal rest, you can pop that in there. It's, you know, you've got quite a lot of space. It pretty much works from the top all the way to the bottom as well. And as I say, that's on that side, and there is also another pocket. Yeah, let me quickly show you that on this side as well. And that is where your plus 10 litres come in handy. So as I say, the core is 60, and using these pockets, you've got the, the five litres either side, which make up your 10. Anyway, for more information, please visit us at simplyhike.co.uk.